hair looks a hot mess already and it's only Monday. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Hello you guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Corey. I am a teacher. I used to work at Sephora, so I enjoy all things makeup related. So we do a little bit of everything here on my channel. Today is Monday and it is my prep period, first period today. Tomorrow we have the ACT, all seniors, no, sorry, juniors. All juniors uh, and sophomores. The sophomores take the PACT and then juniors have a day to take just the regular ACT. So we don't have school that day. Obviously we proctor the exam, but we don't have class that day. So that's what's going on tomorrow. Uh, then I had to go down to the office because I got a package which had a sewing pattern in it for one of my sewing students and then it's kind of a long story, but I had to cut out the pattern pieces for her uh, so she's not getting behind. Figuring out what I'm doing this week, I use my planner so heavily. I plan my personal life in here. I plan my school life in here. But I will say that as a teacher, I don't use my planner for like lesson plans and stuff like that. I will write down like to-do lists. So on here, I will write what days of the week I'm working on next week's lesson plans for each class. And then all of my actual lesson plans are organized on my Google Drive. But like on here, I'll write down what days I'm working out, what days that I'm cooking dinner, uh, what days am I ordering my groceries, what even like I go so far as to what days am I cleaning out my cat's litter box. Here's what's on the agenda for today. Clean out the litter box. Work out, do some laundry, um, prepare a return. Trevor is on spring break this week, so he can do a couple things for me. I will check in with you guys a little bit later. Um, I forgot my vlog camera at home. What else is new? So today we'll be on my phone and then we'll maybe transfer to my camera later. So. <laughs> The hair went up not that long into the day. It was just one of those days. It's after school now. I get to leave in nine minutes. And today, I after school, I finished up some lesson plans for next week. I always try to lesson plan for all of my classes a week in advance so that I'm never, you know, scrambling to plan like the day before, you know? So that's what I was doing after school today. I made some copies. Tomorrow we have the ACT, so I'm not teaching actual classes. Okay, hello you guys. I am back home now, and there is actually a new member of the family that you guys have not gotten to meet yet, and he's eating right now. Sneaky peek. Juju! Hi, good boy. So this is Juju. He is a purebred Shiba Inu. We've had him for about a month and a half now and he is just the sweetest dog. And we got him originally for Trevor because Trevor just kind of wanted slash needed an emotional support kind of like Howard is to me and he wanted a companion. The funny part is that Juju hates Trevor. And Trevor has never done anything to him, has never, like we're, the biggest animal lovers ever, so has never laid a hand on him, has never done anything to scare him or anything like that. So we think that maybe in his previous life, he uh, maybe had some bad experiences with men. I don't know, or maybe it's a dominance jealousy thing with me. We still have Howard, he's my baby. So I just came home, I changed my clothes, and I am going to go work out. I am going to go walk a mile on the treadmill. Just a little bit of activity, get going. And then after that, I should actually probably go put a load in the laundry right now. So we're gonna do that. Holy crap. So uh, I had done a load of sheets. You're probably not even gonna be able to see, but like my sheets are stuck underneath this spinner. Oh my gosh. <clears throat> so now I'm trying to get them out. Come look at this. <clears throat> How does that even happen? Is that where socks go to die? Are socks literally in the washing machine like that? That's where they go? Leave it to women, I got it out. Must be smarter than the machine. 
Got my AirPods on the treadmill. So welcome to my unfinished basement. I'm going to work out for as long as I can. I'm waiting to hear back on Facebook Marketplace from somebody selling a Monstera Deliciosa. And as soon as she gets back to me, I think I'm gonna head out and pick up that plant. Okay, so I bit the bullet and I went and got those plants. So I got a Birds of Paradise and a Monstera Deliciosa. And he's already got like this new leaf over here. I did bring Juju with me. Hi. Hi. <laughs> so I'll see you at home. So here's the bird of paradise that I got. Um, I will repot him into this boy right here. Um, just because it's in this plasticky one. And then here's the Monstera. But there's its brand new leaf. And this one I'm going to have to go buy a pot. This shelf just makes me so happy with all my plantalones. I'm propagating some pothos, some golden pothos here. Trying to propagate some aloe, we'll see how that goes, but. I saw this TikTok, this girl, and she had found gaucho, I'm sorry, you really can't see me. Anyways, it was this girl who had found gaucho pants at Walmart. They actually were so cute the way that she styled them, definitely not how I did it in the early 2000s. Anyways, I bought them and now I bought two different sizes because I wasn't positive what size I was gonna need or want. I am needing to return the pair that did not fit. I'm just packaging that up right now. So since Trevor is on spring break, I'm gonna make him return that for me. I always make Trevor do my returns. Perks of having a husband. So now I'm just looking at my planner again. Um, litter box done, workout done, laundry, working on it. Worked on the return, perfect. Oh, elastic and my return and road rolls. So I was planning, just need to check for a recipe. Oh, I have plenty, plenty of Rhodes Rolls. Rhodes Rolls. So Trevor's actually gonna drive about an hour from where we live to his parents' house. He are just left. Um, the reason that he's doing that is because his parents are kind of redoing their basement. They have a foosball table that they are getting rid of and Trevor wants it for the basement. Do we have a spot for it in the basement? Not really, but that's men for you. That's where he is tonight. So me and the Juju Beans, we're going to go upstairs. Oh, you went in your kennel? All by yourself? He went in his kennel. All by yourself? That's a good boy. These are the dog treats that I use with Juju. They're the Stuart Pro Treat Beef Liver Treats, freeze dried. That's actually the same bucket that my parents have had my entire life. They are very rich treats, so you don't want to give your dog too much. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to stretch, loosen up a little bit, and then I'm going to do my skincare, and then I'm going to get into bed, so. So I just, I put dry shampoo in my hair, so that's what that white cast is. I go to sleep with it like that. So I've done my skincare. If you would like an updated skincare routine, please let me know. I've simplified it a lot over the years. Um, but if you would like an updated skincare routine, please let me know. I always end my night by reading my scriptures. So I'll do that first. Then I write in my gratitude journal. So for each day I sit down, I write down three things that I'm grateful for and then the high of my day. So I'm looking for the positive thing in every day. And then I will sit down and read a chapter of my book. Right now I'm reading Bill O'Reilly's Killing Kennedy. It's a really interesting book. If you like true crime, I think you'd probably really like this book. It's historical and it's uh, non-fiction, so it's really what happened, but it's just, it's really fascinating. So, chapter of that, and then I usually end my night by uh, watching TikTok. So, I will see you guys tomorrow. Good morning, you guys. So, today is a no makeup kind of day because I didn't sleep well at all. So, I told you guys that Trevor was off getting a foosball table. That meant that I was home alone with the animals. We have discovered that Juju really thrives on structure and routine, and Trevor was not the one putting him in his crate to go to sleep. He was absolutely not having it and he was barking and sprinting around the house like a maniac. I'm tired. 
and my head is pounding ferociously. So we are off to work now. Okay, so last time I checked in with you guys, it was this morning. It was an absolutely crazy day at work. I proctored the ACT and then afterwards we had about an hour lunch. Me and some of my coworkers got pizza and then after that we had to send out failing notices. So normally on ACT day, they do a whole bunch of professional development, like one after the other, one after the other. But because of COVID, they're trying to give us a little bit of a break, which is much appreciated. So instead of doing a whole bunch of professional development, they just um, let us have a work day as long as we agreed to check in with our students, email parents, make sure that they know what's going on. So I did that and then the day was pretty much over. And I went to the nursery, the plant nursery, because I showed you guys yesterday, I got those plants and I didn't have a good size pot uh, for repotting my Monstera that I got. So I had to go to the nursery and get a pot for him. And I just barely finished repotting them, so I'll show you now. So here's the Monstera that I got. Brand new leaf here, what a beauty. Look at those fenestrations. This boy over here is looking pretty mature. And then we got some baby leaves down here. And one of my leaves on this guy broke off, so we're already starting a propagation over here. And then we have this beautiful bird of paradise. Oh, look at him. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. So repotted those, gave them some water, and then they're gonna go over on my plant shelf. And I did also buy this beautiful basket while I was there. I'm so tired this week and I really think it was Monday night when Trevor like wrecked me <laughs> by going and getting that foosball table. I think it just wrecked my whole week. First period of my interior design class is working on a color scheme project. Second period is my prep so I'll probably talk to you guys then. Um, my goals for today I need to do my lesson plans for my sewing one class. Hey guys, it is now almost six o'clock. I have a frozen pizza in the oven. What I've been doing, it was kind of a crazy day. I say that every day. I came home, I worked out on the treadmill, and then I was working in the garage, <clears throat> and I filmed a little bit of it for TikTok, so, but this is my peacock chair, so I'm kind of restoring it right now. What I was doing is I rubbed linseed oil into it, and the linseed oil just kind of brings that back that natural color. <laughs> and then I'm gonna shower, throw a load of face masks, <laughs> In the laundry, these have just piled up in my car. I made all of those, so I'm gonna do that and then I'm gonna go to bed. So um, if I do anything interesting, I'll show you. Otherwise, I'll see you tomorrow. I am in my classroom this morning and <clears throat> let's put you in the closet. So it's Friday now and today, so that means that I do not have students today during the pandemic. They decided that we're not going to have in-person on Fridays. However, students can come in to work on missing assignments and remediation work. So I will have a lot of students coming in, especially because next week is my due date for late work. So I'll have a lot of students coming in for that. And then also our state FCCLA competition is not next week, but it's the week after and projects are due today so we'll have our FCCLA uh, members coming in to work on their projects and turn those in. <laughs> 